<laughs> what? Good to see you, man. What? You forget our language? Uh, Kapusi? Maybe a little. I've been here ten years. You could speak English. Remember, we learned that the English girls with the baby. Uh, a little. <laughs> I'm not uh, so good. Cool. You'll be fine. Better than my Serbian. Ah! So good to see you, cousin. <laughs> I can't believe you made it. <laughs> Shit. I have to tell you. It quite the night last night. Two women! The land of opportunity! Ah! I've made it! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Shit, but they're still a touch drunk. A touch? <laughs> My cousin is here! Oh, Back Rome. up to the Holy Come on, come on, yeah, yeah, Whatever, buddy. Just take over the world someplace else, yeah, all right? Buddy. You're in the hey, goddamn go. world! Screw you <laughs> all! On, My man. cousin is here! Here's the fucking man, bitches! Roman, come on, let's go. Uh, to the mansion, huh? Yes, the mansion! <laughs> <laughs> maybe you should drive. Oh, maybe I should. Okay. Okay. Hey, is this a cab? Where's the sports car? Uh, it's in the shop. Come on! <laughs> Drive us to our place on Moha. He's just up the road. I'll let you know when we're there. Why don't you 
Won't you show me around the city? Fucking terrorists! What terrorists? There's been a big scare and you can't go across the bridges so good. You without the pizza, I would stay in Broca. Fuck it, stay in Hope Beach. Everyone likes us does. Nico, you ever had two women at once? Four big titties to be playing with? We are passing the cab office, Nico. This is the business that will take us to the top of the pile. Mr. Sanda, Chiumati, io teach you your right, Chovice. The moment they catch you, die, him up. Gatsum, it's been too long. You should have come out earlier. Think of all the girls you've been missing out on. Our country has women too. Yes, but only locals. Here we have white, black. Americans and the Asians, Europeans on vacation, scared Canadians, bored housewives from the Midwest, every possible choice. The city is like a big Udder milk and ice cream shop. 36 flavors of titty. Hulk Beach is a little corner of Eastern Europe. Kakasha Mampino. Hulk Beach, next to the docks. Immigrants here do not make it very far from the boats they come in on. This is the mansion? <laughs> Just a temporary place. The mansion is coming, cousin. That's the dream. Follow me. <laughs> come in, come in! Make yourself at home. What's mine is yours. Got him! <laughs> Little bastard, if he paid some rent, I wouldn't care. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, that's the place. Oh, cousin, it's so good to see you. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, I need to change anyway. <laughs> so. So. So, so you full of crap or what? What? Uh, where's luxury condo? Where's sports car? Where's Barbara with big titties and Stephanie who sucks like a vacuum? What are you talking about? In your letters to my mother, in your letters to me, all I hear about is Mr. Big, Mr. Roman, living the American dream. Sports cars, condos, women, money, the beach, opportunity. I come here and the only thing big about your life is the cockroaches. <laughs> That's right. I got the best cockroaches, I got the best cats. <laughs> Screw you, you idiot. <laughs> okay, I'm an idiot, but you must admit, I have the best wine and bullshit you ever heard. Yeah, this I know, asshole. Look here. <sighs> All I needed was one good guy. One good guy I could do well. Not take over the world, but do okay. I maybe I have this. But what about you? What about you, cousin? What? What about me? Oh... Uh, why you live home after all this time? First I hear you are uh, running with the wrong kind. Then I hear you join the Merchant Navy. Now you're here. You never tell me anything. <laughs> no. What do you mean, no? No, I never tell you anything. Another time. Ooh, mystery man. Strange and exotic sailor. What happened? Did your captain make you pregnant? <laughs> Screw you! <laughs> no, no, it's nothing like that. The ships were fine. It was before that. Two things. You remember, during the war, we did some bad things, and bad things happened to us. <laughs> War 
is where the young and stupid are tricked by the old and bitter into killing each other. I was very young and very angry. Maybe that is no excuse. Roman? Roman! Are you sleeping, you fat no, fuck? No Come on! What's the time? Shit. I've got to get the cab back. It's on the shift. Stop! Oh, Jesus! This is like a rat shot in it! Nico, Jeez. I've got to run. Uh, come Bro. meet me at the cab office. It's you easy. Out the door, turn left, and the first I left did. at the diner, go down I'm one block and turn right on Iroquois. Then walk all the way down, and we're right there on the left on the corner of Cisco Street. Man. It's really flash. We got lots of TDs and some incredible motors. Nico, give me a hug. Good to have you here, cousin. I've got something for you. Oh, damn. Damn, damn, damn. Uh, yes, Vlad. Uh, sorry. Oh, forgive me, okay? No, no, please don't cut my cock off, eh? Okay, okay but... Yes? Uh, uh. Try to beat our meat! My mother does not live in cage in zoo. Come on, big guy, I'll do some work to get out of here. We don't need jokers. Screw you! Screw you! Baby, when I look into your eyes, it means something. I see little Romans, I see little Mallory's, I see stars, I see angels. In my homeland, we have a saying. Yeah, we got one too. You're a fag! Jesus, <laughs> Roman, you fucking idiota! How can I take you seriously? It's very difficult, I think. <laughs> Hello, Roman. Hello, <laughs> Mallory, this is my cousin I tell you about, Nico. Nico, Hi. this is Mallory, the beautiful girl I tell you about. See? Not everything I tell you is bullshit. I bet most of it was. <laughs> I hope you're less full of shit than your cousin over here. <laughs> Thank you. This is the woman that I'm going to marry. <laughs> Whatever you say. I thought you were going to marry me, baby. Hey, what? <laughs> 
You're fucking crazy, man! <laughs> you should lose few pounds. Otherwise, this beautiful lady is going to lose you. Uh, no, I'm a fat prick. What can I do? Pay you uh, dance? I will, I will do, man. We spoke of this. No, we didn't speak. You spoke. Then you say your phone out of batteries. You treat me like a bitch. Never! I didn't treat you like an idiot, not a bitch, huh? <laughs> I guess it's uh, true. The beautiful woman do like the guys with a funny sense of humor. Ho-ho! <laughs> I'm laughing. <laughs> I'll get you the money. I know. And Roman, tell this fucking yokel here if he doesn't stop staring at me, I'll have his head chopped off and put a film of it on the internet! Ah. Oh, good. Right. <laughs> yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> Like, say what you like, but at least that guy knows how to speak to me. Yes, he's all charm. Come on, Nico, let's go. Darling, I, I'll see you later. I've got to take my cousin around some more. Get him settled. Nico, you're driving us to a hardware store on Dillon Street. Home improvements, Roman. You're going to build this mansion you tell me about? No, oh, funny guy. We're going to get money. In America, you need money to do anything. You're taking me to a backroom game where I'll win all the dollars we need to really see this town. Nightclubs, women, titties. You can play, right? This is over. I am the best. I kick all the asses that play me. They call me the janitor. Because you can't pay your debts and they make you mop the floor? Never a lot, no. Honey, no, I'm the janitor because I always clean up. I always win. Get it? Chistach, Naranto. I seriously hope your cards are better than your net names. Only problem is I'm playing with some money I meant to give to these... Roman, it looks like your money lending friends are here. That's his cat. The fat woman must be in here. Hi, I'm Dr. Steven Monsignor. Now, when my little girl was born, I was more than a little upset. For one, I wanted a pretty child. And secondly, I didn't want her to inherit her mother's looks. 
After divorcing her mom and disowning her, I've dedicated years of my life to ensure others don't experience this terrible pain of random DNA sequencing. Gazin, two guys are going in the store. I think they are the loan sharks you speak of. You better get out of there. All right, all right, I'm coming. Just like in the movie. Shit, Nico, what's them? They must have been told I was here. Roman Pellick, we will find you soon! Remember, do not hurt the loan sharks. The debt will just increase. Get us back to the depot, quick! Just like the old days, eh? In the old days, we were dodging bombs, not loan sharks. Do you think they saw me? Of course they saw you. I mean, you're a distinctive man, Roman. That is why the ladies love me. Fuck those Shylocks, they'll get their money. They just have to wait. We should stand up to them. Gidetti e Pons. Nico, you're new. You don't understand the way things work. Oh, yeah? We are at the bottom of the ladder, man. These thugs push us around, but they are not to be feared. It is the Russian mobsters, glad bosses that run everything. Be careful of them. You tell me to behave, Mr. Janitor? If you understand it all, where is the money? I lost it this time, but when I go back, the last thing they will expect is for me to take everything. Then I really will clean up. Poverevacu, God vidi, Roman. We're here. Oh, you like your phone? Maybe one day you get a premium quality one like mine. Then you will have really made it. I can only wish. See you later, cousin. Daddy, what's your problem? I don't have problem. You do. Don't be a dick, man. Come on. Where's your Russian friend now? Huh? He's not my friend. He's huh? my lone shark. Huh? Stop this. Huh? What are you? Who are you? Get out of here. What? Yes. Huh? What? Ah! 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 Oh! What about you? Get out of here now! And if you come back, I'll kill you! You understand? You forgot this? You have many pricks? Son! Shit, Nico. What did you do? He was going to stab me. Now he's going to kill you. Fuck him! Look at this mess. Screwed! Again! You want to know why I'm not living in a nice condo, banging for women? It's because of shit like this! Assholes! Shut up! 
Melbury. Hey, beautiful! <laughs> uh, yeah, great! <laughs> uh, listen, I, I'm even gonna be the problem at the office. Um, I can do it. Nico can do it. Huh? And what? Then why would you want me then? Uh, well, screw you then! Great girl. Can you do me a favor? Melory needs a lift. Can you go pick her up at the Hope Beach subway station? Yeah. Take the cab. She's got a friend with her. Maybe someone you can date. Fuck you. Oh, man, look at this crap. My computer and everything. Get in, ladies. Hey, Nico. Thanks for coming. I should have known Roman would find some excuse not to turn up. This is Michelle. Hi. How are you? I live on Rotterdam Hill up on Mohawk Avenue. You know where that is? Anytime today. How are you finding America, Nico? Not exactly what I expected. Nico, you know what? You need someone to show you a good time. Michelle, how about you? Mallory, stop it. Come on, you guys. You're both single. You're adults. Take a number, Nico. Hey, I'd like to see you again, Nico. You look like that kind of guy I want to get to know. You look like you just jumped off the boat, Nico. Handsome man like you should get some new threats. I think he looks fine the way he is. I don't think he even chains out of those things on the journey. How are you going to impress a classy girl like Michelle? I'm easily impressed. I know you are, sweetie. <laughs> and I just don't get it. Thanks for the lift, Nico. Yeah, thanks. Give me a call sometime. See you soon, Michelle. Cousin, I dropped the girls off. The friend gave me her number, but I don't think Mallory likes my clothes so much. I know just the place for you. It's on Mohawk in Hall. Go and get something a bit more 21st century.
Hey, Roman, I got some clothes. It looks like they brought the stuff in from the old country, though. We must take what we get. When the big money rolls in, then we will look real classy. Anyway, you have Michelle, a classy girl for your art. You should definitely keep dating her. Hey, Nico, it's Michelle. We met with Mallory, Roman's girlfriend. I remember. What's up, Michelle? I don't normally do this, but I thought you'd probably be pretty lonely having just moved to Liberty City and all. You do not normally do what? You're not making this easy for me, are you? I'm asking you out on a date. I am sorry. I am still not used to how things work here in America. A date would be good. I am getting sick of hanging out with Roman all the time. Uh, how about I pick you up from your apartment? That sounds good. See you soon. Hey, it's Nico. Hey, I'm just finishing my hair. Come in. Thank you. I'll be with you in a minute. Did you just move in? No. Why? All your stuff is new. Some even still have tags on. Yeah, well, I like things clean. I can see that. But uh, everything is new. 
Yeah, I'm kind of obsessed with cleanliness. Things get on my nerves and I just throw them out. OCD or something? Oh. So, where are you taking me? Uh, you look good. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I'm new here. I thought maybe we could go to the, uh, fun fair. Yeah, great. Let's go. Love the fun fair. Actually, we call it um, carnival here. Just a little difference. Uh, whoop de do. <laughs> So, Michelle, what do you like to do? What do you like to do? Come on, I asked you first. I like to keep active, I guess. Sports, working out, things like that. I'd like to know about you, though. See the places you hang out. Yeah, maybe another time. or something. Hey, there's a bowling alley up here. We should play. Sure, bowling sounds like fun. Thanks for taking me out. I haven't been on a date for a while. I'm kind of lonely here. I thought you were doing me a favor by going out with me. You're the local. I'm not a local in Liberty City. I came here from somewhere... Where? Oh, the Midwest. <laughs> you probably know more people here than me. More assholes, maybe.
so you don't know many people here in Liberty City? No boyfriends or husbands or anything? Whoa, no, yeah. I guess I'm married to my job. Well, what do you do? What do you do? Come on, I asked first. I work with Mallory. What do you do, exactly? You're a hard girl to talk to, Michelle. I guess you're not used to talking to American women. So what are you doing here in Liberty City, Nico? What's anybody doing here? I don't know. I think you do. There must be something that made you leave your home and come here. Roman's bullshit stories, maybe. I just felt like I needed a new start. There's nothing else about Liberty City, then? Just Roman? Maybe there is more to this place. I'm not sure yet. Nice. I'm really interested in seeing you again. Yeah, that would be good. I'll give you a call. Please do, Nico. See you soon. from them in the first place, Roman. Anyway, I was seeing Michelle. I thought you wanted me to date her. Not to admit me getting beat up and sent to hospital. Come and pick me up, cousin, and at least tell me that you got her titties out. Maybe then your betrayal will be worthwhile. You have a nice titties, yeah? Move it! You're an animal, Roman. Nothing can stop you being horny. I'll see you soon. to the office, cousin. Uh. How was she, cousin? Tell me how she was. I wondered about Michelle when I first met her. If she was not a friend of Mallory's, it would be me with the smell of titty on my breath and you who ended up in hospital. Firstly, Roman, my breath does not smell of titty. Secondly, I don't think that your loan shark friends could hospitalize me. I can look after myself. All the more reason why I should have hooked up with Michelle. Everyone would be a winner. Yes, well, I will not let these men treat you like that again. I'm sorry for letting you down, Roman. again for not being there for you. You've done a lot for me since I got here. Uh, the choice between some titties and your safety would have been difficult for me as well. Don't worry, Nico. Call me soon.
Okay, Roman. I'm not going to let something else get in the way this time. Where are you? Over in the court, under the L train on Firefly. Blade her, buddy. You broke your point the first time. It was a misunderstanding! Oh! Hey! Shit! There he is! Keep him fat boy here and I'll talk to him! Our problems with your cast! I told you to stop! Now it's too late! Cousin. Yeah. Fine. Fucking lawn sharks, man. If one more of these gangsters tries to... Speaking of shitheads, here's Darden. Come on, my car is over there. Let's get him. You drive. I don't feel so good. Get in the fucking car! These guys think that they're better than me. They think they can fuck me around and beat me! Show them! Fucking dirt and smashing my fucking stuff! Who does he think he is? Just some fucking petty Albanian hood! If I wanted to buy a stolen TV, I go to Dard. Who does he think he's fucking with? Malik Enterprises, that's who! We're going to the top, Nito! The top! For now, let's just try to survive, cousin. He'll come back and trash our place if he gets away! Get him, cousin! You can't let him lose you, Nico! Drive!
Dalton is stopping. He's trying to get away on foot. myself I wouldn't kill people here. Darden ain't a problem for you no more, cousin. Nice one, cousin. Drive back to the depot. These bruises are starting to pain. These men, these Shylocks like Darden, they always try to squeeze you for everything. A man in Europe, another Russian. Moldary. He live on the Adriatic. Believed I owed him money when I did not. He made my life impossible. There was no avoiding him. Did you deal with him like you did Darden and Bleeder? He had too many connections for that. I had to leave. He is one of the reasons I came here. And to see your cousin, of course. Of course. We will have no more problems from now on, cousin. It is all plain sailing straight to the top for you and me. We will see if things are that simple. Thank you, cousin. I'll see you later. Can I have one of them, please? Gracias. Enjoy this item. Great. Thanks. Forget about the fence, sir. Lads, shut up. But he's a serf, and you're a hunter. Uh, talking about serfs. Oh, hey, Nico. Where's Rome? <laughs> Good question. Hey, Yoko, your dumb cousin isn't here. Go get me a coffee. What? Get me a fucking coffee! Come on, I'll get you one. What? You keep staring at me. I'll burst one of your eyeballs. Gorgeous, this guy's a fucking creep. Give him a break. He's new in the country. I can see that. Did you walk here from 1985? Yeah. Excellent. Now stop fucking staring at me. I mean, I know I'm good looking and everything, but come on. Uh, hey, Mallory. Hey, man. <laughs> hey. <laughs> About time. Lad, bloody boy, what's going on? Roman. Roman boy. You tell me what's going on. Nice aftershave, what is that? Sex pest? No, <laughs> it's where is my fucking money? I, I had it, I, I had some of it. Then those Albanians you said you would deal with came and smashed my computer. So it's my fault? I, I didn't say that. Good. Anyway, Nico dealt with it. Broke Darden's arm, then beat up a couple more. Then we teach them a real lesson. <laughs> is that so? I'll tell you what. While you don't pay, maybe you and Nico can do me few favors. <laughs> Good. Why 
find that? Lay to flag. What? The phone's ringing. Hey, yeah, okay. No, I, I can't do it. My cousin will do it. Yes, he can drive. No, he's not a cop. His name is Nico. You'll be right over. Nico, sorry to ask, cousin. Can you go pick up Jermaine, one of my regulars? He's over on Rotterdam Hill on Mohawk Avenue? Whatever. What was this all about? Nico came in looking for you, and Vlad told him to get him a fucking coffee, and Nico didn't want to. Coffee? What was he thinking? I know. for coming. Can you take me over to Masterson Street? Masterson Street it is, Jermaine. Shit, I thought Roman was gonna pick me up. I need someone I can trust for this run. I'm Roman's guy. If you can trust him, you can trust me. Ah, uh, he told me about you. You're Nico, right? The hotshot ladies man cruising around the Mediterranean breaking hearts and making millions? Yeah, I traded in the yacht for this cab. <laughs> That's exactly the kind of bullshit I can imagine Roman making up. You've got to give him credit for his imagination. Yeah, you got it. I had a feeling you sounded too good to be true. The question is, are you willing to get your hands dirty? My hands haven't been clean for a long time. Been here in Liberty City is just making them dirty. Okay, okay. I gotta pick up some hot parts from my locker. You down? I ain't got no problem with that. Just don't tell me if you stole this shit from a hospital or a school for sick kids. My conscience is troubled enough already. That door isn't meant to be open. Wait here while I take a look. Get us out of here! Help, man! You gotta shake these cops! Get off the street, everyone! What you okay. I ain't going down, man! Get rid of this heat! What are you doing? sites for a little longer would be all good. That's a weight off my mind. So what brings you to Liberty City, Nico? Roman, I guess. And some other things. I'm looking for something. Good luck finding them. How's the hunt been going so far? It is not really started yet. I'm getting settled in, you know. Roman has had some issues with loan sharks that needed to be resolved. There's this asshole called Glenn. 
Who he owes money to as well. Good luck with that. Okay, we're here. Thanks, man. Keep looking after Roman, all right? Hey, what's stopping traffic? What is this? I got your friend Jermaine where he wanted to go. Good, Nico. Thanks. I can talk to you soon. Enterprises. Uh, no, uh, Mr. Belik is stepped away from his office. Can I take a message? Okay, great. No, I'm not gay. Yes, I'll, <laughs> I'll tell him. Car seven, head to South Slopes. Come on, where are you, Mohammed? Hello, Roman Belik's up. Shit, fucking battery. This is chaos. Capitalism is a dirty business. Yeah. Like war? Not exactly. No, maybe not. When are you going to tell me properly about what happened? I'm not going to judge you. Uh, when you got time. There, I have time. Another time. Can I help? Okay, yes. Go pick up my friend little Jacob. He's a good man. Likes to smoke a bit. Look after him. He's on Oneida Avenue in South Slopes. Nico, man, we should talk sometime. Uh. I'm a good listener. Whatever, man. Mohammed, what the fucker? Oh, Miss Weinstock. No, no, not you. I, I, what can I do for you today? You, Nico, the one man Roman been talking about all this time. Cousin Nico, gonna help Roman take over the world and think. I guess so. Respect, alright, alright. We're going to this spot where I need him to wait for it. See? We got to ask you another favor, too. Go for it. Can you take this pace? You hear anything bad going down? You come and help, side. Are you worried about this? I know how to use a gun if you want me to keep watch on things. Real this brother. Then my man Roman's cousin. Thanks, respect. This rascal that I rock is with my brethren, real bad man the other day. I want to make peace, but you know what type of shit they might pull out. Alright, there be the spot up there. Watch out for any badness. Sure.
What's this? There's only gonna be one of you's coming. Jacob, Jacob, Jacob. We have to teach a bad man his lesson and thing. Shit, Nico, get this blood Let's clout. Get in there. Right in. Right in. There'll be another one, Nico. Check him. Yeah, man, my bullet that fell in here, pon it. Sorry for Magadag, Magadag turn around and bite you. Come here back at home, bro, cafe. Your real creation step on it. I have had much experience. I think we can do some work together, don't think. In the future, you know? I am always looking for work, if it pays. Here's my number, make a link up so. Thanks for everything. You can keep the peace. I think you know if you use it better than I know. One look. Hey, we Rasta. I don't need to talk. Make we do it. Jacob where he wanted to go. Driving for you ain't as boring as I thought it would be. Jacob is a good man. Watching glue dry with Jacob would not be boring. Thank you, cousin. Jeff, it's Nico. Are you doing anything? You want to meet up? Sure, I'd like that. Can you pick me up in an hour? Okay, see you in an hour. Nice to see you. 
Come on, let's go. Really like the new car, Nico. Ah, oh, you're wearing that again. Good. places like this. Slowly, your country is strange, and your city makes people crazy. How's Roman? Okay. He likes to gamble, though, doesn't he? I don't know about that. Mallory said he was in debt to some criminals. Do you know about that? No. That would really scare me, organized crime, I mean. Me too. Do you think they'll try to involve Roman? I don't think Roman would make much of a criminal. I guess not. Interesting weather, isn't it? Very. I got there was helping you out. You have, you have, but I need no fish. I need more drivers to the captain. I'll pay you properly. Okay then. Just call me whenever you want to take a fare. You can do as many as you like, Nico. There are always more customers. It's the imbecile!
Hey, baby. How you doing? Good. Thank you very much. <laughs> good. Yes, comrade, I am doing good. There is no I, there is only we. It is a glorious system, comrade. <laughs> excuse me? You're excused, comrade. You're excused. Now go and mind self for 50 years. <laughs> You're a dick. I'm a rich dick, friend. I'm young and rich and loaded. Tell you what, have a hundred bucks on Uncle Sam, Benjamin motherfucking Franklin. Freedom! This coke is okay. <laughs> Watch where you're going. Hey! Hey! I tried to tell you. Fuck you! Sorry, I'll we'll see you later. Yoko, Federal Muscaza. What's your name again? Big Mouth Click. Better catch Sit down. Cousin. Uh... Nico. That's it, Nico. Not Big Mouth Click. You're a funny guy. I try. Yes, and this one. I'll let you take this shit out of me. Take this shit? Yes, we gave out. I don't understand. Ah, people who fuck with me, get fucked with! Okay, fine. Calm down. Whatever. Some old man not paid me in months. And I'm not the kind of person who is treated this way. Old bastard owns a china shop in the Camden Avenue in Dukes. Here you go. Don't hurt. Just teach him a lesson. Only the bad will teach a lesson. Let's get out of here. Hey, you pay. I'll speed all day. For me is Lavar Davis and Angela Allen. You two used to be in a relationship. And Miss Allen is suing you for $5,000 to fix damages to a car you did with the... Mr. Davis, can you explain yourself? Your Honor, that female is crazy. Yeah, yeah. Sounds like the truth to me. Court is adjourned. Hey, you're not even going to hear my side of it? Oh, well, shit. Shift almost over. Real crazy. She was fine. She carries herself well. She's got big problems, if you know what I mean. She's all right. I'm feeling her right now. She's a minute cheater. She scratched my brand new truck.
Can't catch you any closer, buddy. I'm just trying to get some information. Here's a fact finding mission. Hey, let me in. You owe Vlad protection money, old man. Big Vlad and his protection money? I so scared. What I need protection from? You think this door is going to save your shop? There's shit I can break out here. Vlad should pay me to tell punks like you to go away. He get no money. Shit brain! I pay up now! I pay up! Here's the money! I hope you and Vlad choke on it! Sure, whatever. Manage to do the job? Get Vlad his money? He paid up. I had to smash the shop up pretty good, but he paid. Don't worry your little peasant head about it. Stupid jerk made a mistake of telling me how much he gets that shit for back east. He's the biggest crook in the neighborhood. Lucky I don't tell his customers what they're paying for. That it? Can I go now? Sure. Get out of my face.
20 minutes after phone message. Be leaving a recording for me after the party has been played. You're going to have your license revoked. What? My friend, smoking in a bar is a crime. Plain and simple. You're joking, right? This is a joke. Hey, Mallory, tell Fatty his cousin is a pig. He just walked in. Great girl. Yeah? Stay away from her. Of course. Now listen. You did good with the piece of the attitude. But now one more peasant is trying to avoid pain. Who? Moskowski jerk who owns the laundry in the Masterson Street. Thinks in this country business is done different. Says he will call cops on us. Okay. So? The jerk needs to be taught a lesson. Give him a bit. Let him know. Might is right. Hey! Stop that smoking back there! First rule! Easy, Let's... buddy! Go on, do what you gotta do. But remember, you see a cop, you don't know me. I see anyone, I don't know you. Ho, ho! Hello, Black Boy. Back, back. Shoot it for you. It's three, you know what Message from Vlad. Shit! Stay away from me! the money you owe him. I'm going to. I've just been having the trouble getting it together. Blood is impatient man. You will be getting the money to him soon, or your wife shall be using your washing machines to get the blood out of your clothes. Do you understand? I do not ask twice for a favor. I understand. I will get it to it. I thought this country was different. I spoke to the law. 
laundry method. He gets the message. He will pay you now. I like your style. You can be an intimidating guy. It's a shame everybody knows what a stupid yoko you are once you open your mouth. Huh? Get back to the bathroom. Dropping it and pretending we are fresh and clean just because we get off a boat in a new place. Stop being so dramatic, Nico. Time is a healer. We live and we forget the past. Nothing helps a man forget, like right round American titties. You have to move on from the things that happen to you and think about all the opportunities in this country. Chances to make lots of money, chances to get college girls and to bed. Jean said they both finish, Soronia. I heard that. I haven't forgotten our language completely.
I bet you're a real sensitive lover, aren't you, sweetie? These are the American titties my cousin told me about. for many nights to come. You mind driving your tired cousin home? Thank you.
Thank you, cousin. We should hang out again soon.